This afternoon at Lala rank a similar storyline for both of these teams. Both squads entering the final weekend of the regular season here in the Hockey East. Both teams mired right now in extended win the streaks. Both teams with the opportunity to put some notches in the win column and enter postseason play on an upward trend. That's the scene we set here as the Merrimack Warriors face off against the Holy Cross Crusaders this afternoon here at Lala Rink. Feeney down deep for Joe Hall. Joe Hall is having a breakout season with 13 points, nine goals, leading the team in both categories. Spinning backhand pass, no one home. Cornelison two on two the other way. Has Reeb going with her. Cornelison off the boards. And try to find Reeb. She was nicely marked there by Feeney, but now Engels Engel has got some fresh legs. Her tuck shot, scores! <laughs> Tegan Angles, fresh off the bench, finds a loose puck, skates it alone, and tucks it inside the far post. And she gives the Warriors a 1-0 lead with 5-19 remaining in the first period. Angles with her team leading 11th goal of the season. And again, maybe some tired legs out there for Holy Cross as they just watch the defender. Get the 1 0 chance in on Brennan. And so, a timely change. And a big goal here for Merrimack as they pull ahead of Holy Cross. Osterveld hard around. And a dangerous pass in the middle, intercepted by Joe Hall. Joe Hall, her centering pass. Finally reached Edmonds after a couple of bounces away. And Maud, it's been out there for a long time. Low shot, save made, and the rebound put in. So the top line tying things up with 11.02 remaining. I think that's Darcy Johal who's been knocking on the doorstep all game long. And I'll for Major. Turned over right at center ice. Lessig. They say no icing here. Elliott turns it over here for Reeb. But now a low shot comes free and put it by Cornelison. Turnover by the Crusaders defense and a fortunate carom that ends up right in front. And Cornelison sends it in. And Merrimack back ahead two to one. As Quali able to clear the zone as it goes towards the empty net, will go wide, but now Quali wins the icing race. Quali waits, holds, has Osterveld in front, couldn't find her. Now Maud, her shot blocked in front. Inglis will take towards, and she scores! So Engels, the opening goal of the afternoon, and perhaps the final one that seals this for the Warriors, the empty net tally with just under 35 seconds remaining. Makes it three to one for the Warriors, and perhaps the bow on this one. So Angles with their 12th goal of the season, and that will do it. So the Warriors able to stave off the comeback efforts of the Crusaders. They scored a three to one victory here at Lawler Rank. Go to 624 and one on the season. And they put that 14-game winless streak behind them, a big victory to start up the weekend.